Hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Olympia Rising. Uh, it's a Metroidvania platformer. I don't haven't paid a whole lot of attention to it, but I saw the I kn know of the artist that does did the art for this game, and he did a damn good job. So I was like, yeah, let's give it a shot. Password. Oh, this is concerning. This actually might be a ridiculously hard game. Speaking of, I should probably turn down the audio before I just get totally dunked by something. Because you know what? I just got off of uh, I just got off of Swindle. And let's be honest here. Swindle was not pleasant. So, starting a new game, we'll erase the current autosave. Continue. Yes. Where am I? Oh, it's autosaving. Oh, I'm waking up. So, can I? Oh, no. Okay. This is going to be awkward. All right. Oh, uh, you know what? I've never done this before. This might work. All right, so PS4 controller, slightly more ergonomic for using the D-pad. So, uh, let's just do new game, seeing as we missed nothing. Oh man, it is warm. Actually, I should probably turn on things. What is my backlog on Feist? There is no backlog. If you've seen episode one, that's as far as I've been. So, in the fields of Asphodel, at the edge of Hades, you gave your last mortal breath. All right, so this game this game is very, very retro, very Metroidvania. The camera controls are a little bit wiggly, but apart from that... Oh, I've already got my sword. Nice. All right. In the afterlife, the memories of your great battles and hardships were erased. Your soul was soothed. Fountain. Yay. So why are we on this journey again? Seems like a pretty nice place to just hang out. Okay, if you're reading my notes, then you know the danger has returned. The answers to your past lie in Olympia. All right, let's go. Let's go kick Zeus in the nuts. Hey, sweet. This must be. Uh, I guess we're just Kratos in a skirt. Anyway, wait. No, Kratos always wears a skirt. Ha! I guess with slightly more clothes on and hair. Before he grew that goatee. Anyway, you must enter Hades and climb from the depths to learn your destiny. Time to leave. Time to leave. All right. Yeah, this game is gorgeous. Love the pixel art for it. All right. Uh, your awakening in this time is no coincidence. For the for soon the purge of Hades will begin. The purge occurs once every hundred years. The gods punish the restless spirits with a great flood of acid. Oh, well, that's not pleasant. Oh fuck, Cerberus! Not gonna lie, I was not expecting that. Uh, as the purge happens, it becomes possible to escape the underworld, but only if you can ride the rising torrent. Okay, so we just got smacked around by Cerberus a bunch. Hey there! You must be Iola! I'm Sharon. Nope, well, maybe you've realized it yet, but you're in the underworld. No more sunshine for you. Considering you didn't change into an ugly ghost, you must have a strong spirit. You probably want to get back to what you were doing on the surface world, right? Here's the deal. I'll guide you out of this wonderful establishment, but for a price. An otherworldly gatekeeper can never have enough cash. And that's where you come in. Kratos. Okay. Here in Hades Domain, uh, baddies walk around like they own the place. Luckily for you, they carry shiny Oblitz coins, which you will give to me. If you fill my pockets with enough of those shiny delights, I'll let you through each gate. If you fail to bring me uh, the amount I need, I'm going to take them and you're, you'll start over. Let's give it a go. Bring me five coins. This should be simple for a warrior like yourself. Okay, all clear. I wish you the best luck out there. I'll be waiting for you at the next gate. Okay, sticks. So what do we got? Okay, so we can attack. We've got three health. Very Metroidvania. Oh, what a... Oh, there's a double jump. Nice. That's what we get here. Is there like a... There is a wall jump. Nice. Okay. So fun fact about me. I've never actually played a Met... Ooh, whoa. There's like a... Ground side. Okay, I gotta test this. Is there falling damage? Not as far as I can tell. Cool. All right, I don't know what these potions do. Oh, magic. Okay, help. Let's see, dash through the sky using uh, power of air. Hold jump all in the air and maneuver freely in any direction. Ah, well, now we're dead. Six, six? I don't know. Anyway, you don't always have to pulverize those baddies by jumping around them instead. I mean, that's not necessarily the issue we're facing here. The issue we're facing here. Oh, whoa. Well, that goes a lot longer than I gave it credit for. All right. Uh, use your blade to slay any creature that blocks your path. Press attack to use. Okay. Hey, we have more than enough coins. 
Let's see what we got here. I'm loving the controls in this game. All right, let's see if I take falling damage. No, none. Perfect. Okay, hit it when Wanderbot loses his train of thought. Remind me and I'll get back to it. But has to be at least a little bit understandable considering this is a game. Okay, air dash takes mana. Ah, that that would be why I, I could only, well, I can do it for practically forever. Well, we got a lot of these around. I'm liking that. But yeah, the camera controls are a little bit wiggy. Wiggly, not the end of the world. Uh, hit the torches? Doesn't look like you can do much to the torches. Okay. Not there. Okay. Yeah, died within the first five minutes. I mean... Oh, here we go. Use pure magic to torch enemies from a distance. Hold down and press attack to cast. Okay, so if I do... Nope! Oh, yeah, of course. Directly next to the... God, oh, wait, no, I, I need to pick up the pure scroll. Nice! Oh, and I don't I don't even need to um I don't even need the torch. I can just use it whenever. Cool! Digging this thus far. Can I go out? Yeah. Color Sonus area. I what? Okay. Excellent, your toll has been paid. Bring me 30 coins in the next passing. I'm digging this game. It plays very well. I'm interested to see. Oh, this is probably gonna be a timed venture. But, like, the controls are hella tight. Like, I... Ow. That was a hit. Oh, shoot. I took damage from something. Oh, shit! We're timed here! I thought so. So we need to... We need to traverse this. We're dead. <laughs> Iola. Iola? Yeah. Okay, so she does, like, sonic dashes and stuff. She does wall climbs. This is perfect. This is, like... I like Shovel Knight a fair amount. Oh, right, I was going to talk about not playing Metroidvanias. That's what a, that's the topic. I derped. Yeah. Uh, so, I have I did not grow up with Metroidvanias. It was not in my... What is that? I don't even know. Uh, it was not in my childhood to play Metroidvanias in any way, shape, or form. Uh, the first Metroidvania I ever played was in college. I was actually playing Metroid Prime... Uh, Metroid Fusion. For the Game Boy Advance. And, uh, it was fun. It was hard. Okay. Did take damage there, but I think we're okay. Just gonna go with that. Yeah, we don't have to pick... Once we've touched the coin the first time, we don't have to worry about it in any other shape or form. That's good. That that health? Oh, yeah, it is. So there, there are plenty of health pickups along the way. And it looks like, yeah... I don't even know how many of these we need. Probably just run away at this point. Yep, I don't even know what that was. Yep, let's not get trapped in here. Perfect. I forgot to grab the air spell. No, we started with air. Air was, uh, air's the, the flying thing. Grew up with a lot of awful Sonic games. I mean, maybe? Ooh, what's this? Uh, mm, well, that's not, that's not useful. I don't, I don't know. Oh, that's the password. Because there, there's a password system in this game. I, I'm worried about that. Anyway. Uh, use the power of air while holding up. While jumping. After a regular double jump to reach even greater heights. Quick. Well, this makes sense. God, the controls in this game are perfect. Like, I was a little bit worried that it was uh, requiring me to use the double jump. But in this case, we're good. Create chains by slaying multiple foes in succession without landing. Chaining earns you more coins per kill. Okay. BAM! That was satisfying. Okay, and it doesn't look like we have to worry about anything. Damn! Oh man, I could totally see like a speedrunner just eating the shit up like crazy. Oh, I bet if you had like a crazy train, uh, crazy chain train there, you could totally, um, like get a major multiplicate multiplicative on, uh, on the loot. Okay. 60 coins in the next passing. Yeah, damn, this is a good game. Oh, shit! Okay, so we've got to get 60. Should be a, shouldn't be a problem. Got to worry about hammer man. Okay, so enemies do do contact damage in this game, which I'm not happy about. I don't like contact damage. We're dead. Oh, well. Uh, doesn't look like we have to worry too much about uh, lives, though. Like, there's no limitation there. 
which is good. Oh, and we're dead again. Blech. Okay, but this this is a solid game. I hit the high things. Oh, the sound effects are getting to be. Oh, I don't have any magic. Go figure. I can't. Ah, uh, can't do anything fancy. Okay, there we go. Out. Do not stand on the creepy ass skeleton man. I don't even know. Have I ever played Wings of Eye? Nope. Okay. Let's see. Let's see a frozen wolf. Have a good one. Okay, so we don't have any magic. So we can't do any crazy jumps. Gotta be... A little bit weirder of that. Okay. We're dead. <laughs> I... Hmm. Is it obvious I don't play games like this very often? I guess I do. I just am not... I'm not... Uh, repping myself particularly well here. Okay, you know what? How many coins do we have? Ah, that didn't work. Yeah. No, this is, this is pretty good. I just wish I was good. Uh, contact damage is the bane of my existence. Yeah, I don't like contact damage in games. Like, it makes sense if the enemy was, like, spite spiky or has, like, no other discernible attack pattern. But even then, that's kind of lazy design as far as I'm concerned. Okay. But, ah, oh god, those axe guys are rough. Not seeing the Metroidvania aspect of this game. Yeah, no, I thought it was a Metroidvania, but it looks like it's just kind of a generic retro-style platformer. I think, um, Kid Ic fuck. I think Kid Icarus is the, uh, the closest game I can think of. I don't know. I don't, like I said, I didn't grow up with a whole lot of these games, so my, like, my knowledge of this specific genre is, is a little bit limited. Damn, they have a lot of health. Okay. I'm a little bit worried. Mm. Damn. Yeah, more arcade than anything else. I don't know. The difficulty spiked really hard there. But I mean, honestly, I think it's just... Just a limitation on, like, my ability to play. The current endurance I've got hand-wise. Okay. Let's grab the potion. Okay. Damn. Yeah, the problem is I've got, like, next to no, um... Try ducking. There's no ducking in this. There we go. You know what? Let's try going this way. Okay. Let's just get whatever magic we can get without getting smacked around too much. Well, our timing is looking good. Our cash is not. Oh, crap. Okay, how much cash do we have? I'm gonna have to fight this guy after all. At least I'm, like, directly beneath him. Does that give me anything? Okay, watch out for the spiky plants. For they hurt quite a lot. How are we good? Okay, we're good. Let's just get out of here. I don't know if, um... Uh... Okay, toll has been played. Oh! 90 coins of the next passing. Oh! Shit, there's carryover. Okay. Fascinating. So that means there's less exploration? Oh, shit, there's, there's like a little scorpion -y thing. And we're dead. <laughs> hey, Vavix. Hey, Blaze. How's it going? Uh, let's see. Play Super Hexagon. To, uh, get me used to slower-paced games. You son of a bitch. 
That's not even remotely close to a good idea. I've played Super Hexagon. That shit is, in a word, very freaking hard. It looks like I get an extra jump every time I uh, stab a bitch, though. At least we're finally getting some magic here. Okay, and I don't know what those... Oh, shoot. I don't know what the... Fuck. I don't know. Hey, Jerwolf. I didn't... Oh, yeah, you did say something. Um... I don't know. I'm I'm having a bit of a doozy of a night. I'm playing nothing but stressful games. Stressful games that are going to kill my fingers. Why do I play all these games? Because they're fun, I guess. They, they're very well done. Like, this is quite possibly one of the, the so most solid games I've ever played. I just wish I was better at it. For obvious reasons. Okay. Oop. Hello, magic. I'm trying to I'm trying to soak up as much magic as I can get my hands on. Now oh shit, I did actually get hit there. Okay. And he immediately just axes me in the face. Ma This is this is this is a cool game. No, like I dig it. This I not quite on par with Shovel Knight. For I mean, just because Shovel Knight is a downright masterpiece. That said, this is fairly good. I just wish I wasn't so garbage at it. But, eh. Okay, I will I will master it. Like, th this is the totally the sort of thing that you can master with enough practice. Enough finger endurance. Which I do not currently have. I do kind of wish you could, uh, you wouldn't lose your chain. Until you took damage, but it would make a lot of sense to do it the other way. Okay, how many coins are we at? We're doing fairly well. Let's see what kind of nonsense we can get. Fuck. Nonsense we can get into. Never mind. Ow. Yeah, I'm going to give this a couple more tries, and then I'll probably switch to something a little bit less finger, finger intensive. I dig the comboing system, though. The combo system is so much fun to do. I don't have any more magic. Damn. And you can't you can't chain slide through those things. Oh well. I just made a fair amount of money anyway. So that's not really a big deal. Oh, did end up taking damage from him. Oh. Oh, there's even, uh, there's even, like, uh, extra stuff. So, Steridin. No. No, there there will be no Steridin tonight. Okay, so that guy... Problem. Let's go down. Let's look around. Yeah, I'm not gonna be playing tor Choice Chamber, either. Uh, let's see, what do we have after this? I don't actually remember. I do kind of wish heart pickups were a little bit more prevalent in this game. Because it's so easy to just get hit. I don't know. Okay. I don't even know what that is about. That that scroll thing. Like, I got hit there and I didn't even realize it because, fuck, you know what? Let's just let that happen. Okay. So maybe we should we should take our time. That said, son of a bitch. All right. Oh, what? What the fuck? Ground bat? We're. Mm. He blended in perfectly, too. Might like Space Ranger. Maybe. Never heard of it. And we're dead. Damn it. Yeah, I think if this game had like a. a a Shovel Knight style drop attack. That would actually be probably one of the better features, just because a lot of enemies, like specifically above and below, tend to be able to hit me for generally poorly ex explained reasons. Mostly just because I don't see them there, uh, because of the camera limitations. 
So it's kind of a matter of, like, being more aware, kind of knowing where they are. But yeah, it's so easy to just, like, fall directly it fall directly into a specific enemy type. Hey, we didn't actually need the healing that time around. Probably should have left that behind. It's just Torch's ass. Okay, yep. I'm not gonna try combo here. Okay, that's money. How are we doing on coins? We're st still 30 away. That is rough business. At least we get some health. Okay, we're still we're still here. We're still not dead yet. Oh, I'm out of fire. Fuck. God damn it. All right. Well, I mean. We're getting places. I'm definitely better than I was like 10 sec 10 seconds, 10 mi minutes ago. I don't know. At least we're not dead yet. And this time I'm not just going to immediately- fuck. Yeah, the bat can hit you from- Okay, so the bat will do its like, downward tail swipe. And it still hits you, I think that might be part of the reason why I'm getting like, befuddled by them. Because it's just like, it doesn't even make sense. In terms of an attack pattern. Ow. Fuck those guys swing fast. Like, you do not want to fight? You do not want to fight them, ever! Like, the dudes with the axes attack way faster than I do. Which is surprising, I have no idea how to deal with that. Fuck. But yeah, the, the bats blend perfectly with the environment. And, uh, the axe guys just swing really fast. And, like, the problem is I know all of these things, and I know generally direct counters. To all of these enemies. Ah. Well, that works. Alright, we're done. Just fuck that guy. Uh, let's see. Let's try not to take damage here. Okay, we're almost dead. Okay. Get a little bit more health. Okay. So easiest way to beat those guys is in a direct swinging war. I had no idea. Which is kind of absurd. Ah, stupid. Just keep your distance. I don't want to deal with you. Last enemy. Yeah, I got it! Perfect! Alright, let's see if you counted enough. Oh, let us pass. Yes! My toll's been paid. Don't worry about bringing me anything next time. What? Oh, no. Cannibalistic bone, bone Crusher, the Cyclops. Alright, time to fight this bastard. Okay. We're almost dead already. He's not even attacking yet. He's just... He's just... He's just throwing his weight around. He looks like Patrick Star too, which is... Oh, gonna drive me insane. But... Damn. Alright. This is... Just gonna go poorly. I don't even know if he has attacks. He he could totally just like go left and right and probably win. Oh shit. Because we're not playing perfectly. Because we're not playing perfectly, we lost all of our extra coins. Oh shit, he's angry. Oh, what? The fuck was that? He's got a goddamn fucking laser eye! What even? What even? Hey, small baby man. Motherfucker is a late goddamn laser eye. And we're almost dead already. There we go. Yeah, so there's like... Oh, it is very hard to like attack this guy just because of the way this game works. I guess I'll have to pick my hits very carefully. 
the problem is, like, it's very easy to just slide straight into him and then take crazy damage. Hi. This is... This is a game. This is a boss. Alright, let's slow it down. Oh. Okay. That's a good way to get around him. Ow. Did he get faster? Fuck! Well... Is it just the same process at this point? Probably. I don't know if he gets any faster. But you can't you can't give him a whole lot of room. Otherwise bad things happen. Okay. Looks like it's just one basic process here. Oh crap. I didn't kill one. Huh. Nope, can't attack him as I go over. Oh, stay away from the laser goddamn beams. And we're dead. We land on his shoulder, and we're dead. Oh well. At, at least we seem to have the process down, so this isn't a terrible, terrible thing. Oh, right. Can't back myself into a corner. That's how I take damage. Fuck. Thought I had just a little bit of time. Alright. Uh, you know what? Let's just accept accept death. We're just gonna mess mess our head up. Uh, mess our face up? I don't even know. Yeah, so we've lost all of our bonus coins. So I can assume playing through this game flawlessly makes the game damn easy. Because you don't have to worry about a gosh darn anything, really. Okay, not worth it there. Oh, he's got laser beams. Okay, so that's not based on health. Yeah, he even walks like Patrick Star. I should know. I've animated him. What? No! 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 No, 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 no. Fuck you. Fuck your shit. That was... I was outside of the beam. I was totally outside of the beam. He still hits me with it. Goddamn fucking laser eye beams that can hit you from, like, two feet away? That's not cool. Not cool. I don't know how much health he has left either. This is a case where a health bar would be nice. Okay. Somebody would give me some food. How much health do you have, Mr. Goddamn C Cyclops? Because there's no indication. There's none. The coin got stuck on the ground of all places. Okay, well we've learned our lesson. Okay. So far so good. Just really wish I knew how much health he had. At least he's just a process. I mean, that's true of anything in video games, but still. Oh, come on, do not waste this wander. This is the farthest we've gotten. Oh, that was a lot closer than I wanted it to be. Okay. Nope. Okay, we don't have to worry about any rogue bats. I think I hit him there. Okay. I really wish there's an indication. Is he even getting more f frequent with these things? I have no idea. And we're dead. Because I totally wasted it. Ah, oh, man. Oh, man. This is rough. Ah. 
Oh. Was I just not hitting him? I wasn't hitting him. I wasn't hurting him. I didn't get a single hit in that entire time. That's why I wasn't dying. Because he doesn't take damage until he's in the corners. Fuck. Okay, well this is good to know. Unfortunately, there's no generally good indication of when he's going to be... Switching around. Okay, do I know who Northern Lion is? Yep, I do know who Northern Lion is. Is that... I don't know. Okay. Fuck. You know what, I'm just gonna let this happen. Okay. This is, uh... A hard boss fight. There was no indication that I wasn't doing damage to him, right? Either. Fuck. Unfortunately, when you when you move forward, there's also like a, a slidey, uh, a slidiness to your your attack that makes it very easy to just go slide tackling straight into an enemy. I was very close. Come on, goddamn Patrick Star. I gotta remember, I've got a lot more reach on this attack than I thought I did. Oh, staying away from that. Yeah, so now we're doing damage to him. Fuck. Okay, that was closer than I wanted to be. Okay. Take the bat out. Now one trick is... I don't actually have to, like, move laterally there. Need more iframes. Fuck. Well, that was an adequate number of iframes. It really was. Shit. We're dead. Hi. This game is, uh, unfriendly, to say the least. I'm loving it, though. Like, I... This is a very solid... Ugh. Fuck. I'm just gonna accept it. God, it is so easy to just get rampate... Uh, just... <laughs> ravaged by this guy. I don't know. I don't have, like, a good word to describe what he does. He effectively just, like, blubber knots straight into- fuck. He just blubber knots into me and I die. Fucking blubber knots, man. They're the worst. I mean, you, you got dreadnoughts and you're like, ah, you know what, Dread dreadnoughts are scary business. Nah, nah, it's fucking blubber, blubber knots. Look at him. Look at this one. Can't deal with it. Too much blubber. Too much blubber. Only death. Son of a bitch. Out of range. Just barely out of range. Fuck. Ow. I give up. Patrick beats Wander. Fucking... I'm gonna have an unhealthy f fear of, like, walrus people after this. One-eyed walrus people. Why walrus? I mean, you gotta have- it. he's got so much blood blubber, he's gotta be related to a walrus. Look at those man-teats, though. Mmm, they are not friendly- They are not friendly-ass man-teats, to say the least. Oh, I beam time. Interesting, he only- only ever shoots them from the right side. I don't have much of an option on that one. Oh. That bat went low. It doesn't make sense for the bats to go... Fuck. Crotch crushes you. Constantly. His power... Is in his, uh, rectal... Rectal thrusts? No. Gro groinal... Groinal thrusting? Yeah, I guess so. He must keep, like, a ten-pound brick in that goddamn loincloth of his. At least we move fairly fast, but this is just doing... Murder to my hands. At least I've kind of got a process down. But now that I know I have to hit him when he's standing still, that makes it a lot harder. And of course, missing is just the worst. Okay. Come on. We can do this, Wander. Oh, time to leave. 
Okay, yeah, this is... What? I took damage there! I jumped... I jumped too much, apparently. Or I... I did not attack soon enough. Oh, I got him! Yeah! Swickety Swooty's coming for that booty. I mean... Hey, we get an extra HP container. Nice! Ow. Ow. Okay. Let's... let's leave. You trimmed the fat off of him real good, right, Eola? He must have been... he must have really appreciated that tummy tuck. If he gave you that heart. I don't know, bring me a hundred coins next time I see you. No, no. You know what? You know what? You know what? Fuck you. Oh wait, shit. Turns out I don't drown in a little bit of health. Do I drown in this amount of health? No! Can I get killed by this thing? Yes! It's downright adorable. But my- my hands. Oh god, my hands. Oh yeah, I love the little portrait in the bottom left. It's great. Let's go back to the title screen. Okay, load autosave. Good. And we've got a password, so let's record that just in case. It's been recorded. Now we leave. And now we go play something much easier on my hands. There's no there's no button to leave. Ah. Oh. Guess Alt F4 is the only way.